Big story today, the third female four-star general in Air Force history now calls Wright-Patterson Air Force Base home. She took command today during a ceremony that also marked the retirement of another powerful female. A historic moment at Wright-Patterson Air Force Base. You saw two engineers change flags today. Isn't that awesome? Two women engineers, isn't that even more awesome? It was the first time a female four-star general transferred command to another female four-star general of a major command. So by doing this today, perhaps there are a lot of young women that see that, yes, I can achieve uh, things that I never thought were possible. General Ellen Palikowski took the reins of the Air Force Materiel Command from General Janet Wolfenbarger. Chief of Staff of the U.S. Air Force, General Mark Welsh, presided over the ceremony. She is eminently qualified and ready for this challenge. The command employs some 80,000 people and manages $60 billion annually. It keeps the Air Force weapon system ready for war. General Palikowski says the first thing she wants to do is meet with fellow base leaders. And formulate our plan as a group as we move forward and bring this command to the next level. She's an advocate for science, technology, engineering, and math education, or STEM, and advises command contractors to be agile. We need to be able to move quickly, to be responsive to what the Air Force needs, and to be able to work closely together and, and eliminate all those hurdles that slow us down. The ceremony also marks the retirement of General Wolfenbarger. She served in the Air Force for 35 years. Both General Polakowski and Welsh called her a true leader and pioneer. As I left the United States Air Force Academy in 1976, Janet walked in the door as a member of the class of 80. She was one of the first women admitted to the academy after President Ford opened all our service academies to women. Three decades later, history is still being made, and Dayton continues to soar into the record books. Air power. Its DNA comes from Dayton. General Wolfenbarger is a Beaver Creek graduate and thank the community and all the people in the command today.